sub <laughs> subscribe. Cardi Kaizoku. This video is sponsored by Card Market, Europe's largest online marketplace for trading card games. We have Prona versus Sakazuki. We'll go second. We work with this good mid game kind of hand. We'd we'll like to have Gekomoria guaranteed though, but can't have everything, right? Okay, Tashigi, what is that playing for them? Hound Blaze. A lot of people call this card Hound's Blaze, but there's no S, right? We'll just play Rosinante so they can Hound's Blaze it. Okay, they cycle, so Virgo, Sabo. They have a Hound Blaze in hand. The Hounds of Blaze are Rosinantes. That goes with Tashigis for 5. Take that and then we'll counter the leader hit for 6. Yep, counter for 2. Um, we'll attack them for 5 and then just play Ryuma. They take. Even get a Greater Option trigger, great. Do we need Brook? Yeah, they play Porcelino, so let's get rid of the zero, zero cost counter. So Ryuma, the Tashigi, and pass. We hit him with the Brook and make him trash three? Or uh, untrash three? Does that affect him? Not really. He doesn't have too many good Moria targets just yet. Brand new is one though. Pick up another Hound's Blaze. We'll need an Eruption to make our Ryuma low enough. Oh, it's Sudo works too. The Hound's Blaze attack us for 8. I'm glad I countered the 6k earlier then, because we're going to go down to 2. We don't have any good targets to bring back with Gecko either. We might have to Sabo next turn. Oh yeah, we, we definitely have to Sabo. Okay, attacks us for 8. After doing what we described earlier, we'll take... Ooh, Borsalino. Ooh, another Gecko. Okay, let's try to count counter with the Borsalino. We can do Dawn Leader, tap... Brand new, kill him. I don't know, maybe I shouldn't kill him so that he can't get it back with uh, Gekko Moria. Play Sabo though. Sabo though means Saturday. Um, if he's not playing Borsalinos now, maybe I just get rid of Brook. And I yeah, will just get rid of Borsalino now. Since we're going to bring him back next turn, whether we counter or not, we can just use Extra for counter if we need. We're at 8 before he is. We can only bring back Borsalino though, that's kind of bad. I want to bring back two things. Okay, Rebecca. Rebecca. At least we can back to back Gecko, but yeah, we can only bring back Borsalino one time. I guess we have Doflamingo as another option after that. Ooh, they pick up a Sabo from their trash. That's a next turn kind of thing. Bring 8. Then we might have to go to 1. Should I just block with Sabo? Yeah, I think I'll block. Block. Okay, um... Tap Rebecca. Go Rebecca. Gecko, bring back Orsa, and that's it. Pass. And he'll play his own Gecko, I'm assuming. Right, it'd be weird if I had one and he didn't, since he cycled like half his deck by now. Get extra twice. Is that better? No, it's probably better to go flamingo. Okay, they greater optioned our Borsa. They can bottom deck him. Ice Age and then Murakumo. That would be devastating. And then he'd go back in my deck. I can't bring him back out with the Gekomoria. That would suck. Oh, they Helm Blaze. That goes for nine. We have to take, then Sabo, Sabado, Domingo. Yeah, my Gecko brings back nothing. Rick, what do I do here? Not much I can do. Oh, we can play another Sabo. Then brand new to fill our discard with something nice. I think we brand new first. Ice Age. 
and Sabo. At least we can bring back a Kuzan. Uh, what else do we get rid of? Probably another Gecko. I don't need three. If I Ice Age through Sabo, I can tap it now. Is that worth it? Doesn't seem like it. I think I'd rather save it for their Gecko Moria. Yeah. Save it for their Gecko. I'll do 8k leader. They take Gecko 9. They block counter 4. Crazy. Pass. Okay, what are they gonna do? What am I gonna do? We filled four cards in the discard and it didn't really help us out too much. <laughs> okay, they cycled out our Luchi because we're immune for the turn anyway. 7k. 7k, we counter out of this, I believe. We'll save one X Drake in case we can Ice Age X Drake. I haven't drawn a single Ryuma either. They play Gecko. Okay, we're gonna kill that guy. They bring back Rebecca, right? Rebecca. Brand new. Oh, Borsalino. Tashiki. Interesting. Find a Hina with that. Ooh, 10 cost to Flamingo. And I just die on the clapback if I play Doflamingo, right? He has enough attackers. So I cannot play Doflamingo. So we'll do brand new 3 at Tashigi. Ice Age the Gecko. Tap him. X Drake him. I have no counter. Yeah, I think I just die. Hit her 8. But maybe he doesn't know that. It take. Gecko 10, maybe they block, but if I was them, I'd take and then just go for lethal. Yep, they take Frick. Yeah. We just found nothing good to bring back with Gecko, unfortunately. Or else I would have played another one by now. Yeah, no Rosinantes, they bottom decked our one Borsalino, no Ryumas. Lucky unlucky. You can just swing with leader for 5, test the waters. Oh, they play Rebecca. They're not trying to end just yet. It does give me hope, but they play Hina. Oh, they're going for like the guaranteed kill. Right, Houndblaze. Bottom deck him. Or something. He's probably planning out his turn, assuming we have 6k counter in hand. But it's actually 0. Oh, they play Luchi too. And go 5, 6, 7. Maybe he doesn't attack with the blockers. He doesn't have to, right? He just wins on the next turn. Yeah, swings at us for seven and then just passes, right? That can't get rid of three blockers. We'll take... Or Solino. Yep. He's too smart. Okay, we tap Borsa. We just have... I hope we have enough attack power to get through five cards in hand. I doubt it, though. What else can we do? So that's it, really. Okay, we can do 9, 9, and 10, 10, everyone 10. 10 from Gecko. If they can count out of this first hit, I just automatically lose. So, yeah. Don't know what they're. Oh my god, that's every single card in their hand. What we lose then? Well, let's see. No, what am I talking about? We die for sure. <laughs> A leader, 6 into Borsa. x Drake into Hina, they block with Rebecca. Play Gecko Moria, we can still play Gecko Moria. For fun. He's on brand new. Take a Borsa. And we die. Let's rematch, we just got unlucky. Okay, one more, one more. Feels 1k counter. Off. Less, we would have won that, actually. Okay, we'll keep this. We finally have a Ryuma in our starting hand. Right, yeah, because he wouldn't have been able to counter any of my 10Ks. We'll play out to Baby 5 and pass. Let's hope Baby 5 lives. Okay, they play brand new. Baby 5 is a liver. Okay, they pick up Tashigi. We will tap brand new. Baby the 5. 
I can only take the flamingo. Do I need two? Here, let's take two. Kill brand new. Play Rosinante, it's like the perfect board to Luchi. I guess if they Luchi, we'll just save baby five and then they'll swing leader at baby five. Wait, that doesn't sound like I come up ahead at all. Okay, they play the Shigi instead. Now, do I save my Ryuma for something or should I just play it on curve? I think I just play it. And then we have nothing for the next few turns. Let's hope we find something. I just burped. I'll cut that part out. Unless it's funny, I'll keep it in. 5k at baby 5. I guess we'll just block. Right, if we have nothing to do, might as well search. We have to play Hinus. We can kill Hinus instead. Okay, we'll tap Hinus. We'll attack their leader for 5. Then we'll Ryuma and then we'll search. Counter 1, maybe 5 search. Uh, I can only take another 10 cost Dofi. And uh, clogging our hand up, Ryuma kill Hina pass. So Tashigi kills baby 5. And then they bottom deck our Ryuma somehow. Yep, there's a great eruption. Bottom decking is so devastating against our deck because we need cards in our discard for Gekko Moria. Gekko Moria. They kill baby 5. It could be a Luchi killing our Ryuma if they have 4 down up. No pounds blaze. That goes for 10. We'll take. Maybe we drop out the Virgo instead of X Drake. Ooh, Borsa is good. I like Borsa. Borsa and then 3 Dawn. Ooh, I like Sabo. It will just kill Tashigi. Play Sabo first. Discard. Dofa. Is on. We'll pass. That's all we can do. I was hoping to find like a brand new or something. Okay, we're at 9 next turn. They're gonna Ekomoria this turn. I don't think I have anything to deal with it. If they do, I oh, know the Great Eruption. They Borsa or Sabo. And attack us for 5. Um, we'll counter 2. Ice Age. Okay, we can do that. At least. Ice Age, Borsa, tap them. Extra kill. Leader 8. Pass, and then we can just drop back to back Doflamingos next turn. Next two turns. I don't know if that'll save us though. But whatever they bring back with Gekomori, we can tap. He's gotta have it by now, right? Yup. Yerp. Bring back a Hina. Interesting. And a Tashigi. And they... Downblaze are extract? Did they have one? I forgot. Okay, they just, just tutor it from Tashigi. Great. Perfect. Just get everything you need. There he goes. Like me for 9, 8. Take that. It will tap Hina. Back them for five. They take the flamingo. Freeze, freeze, freeze. Pass. And then he's gonna do what? Two ice ages. Get rid of our do flamingo. Or play another gecko moria right now. That would be devastating. If we can afford it, I think I'd like to play a sabo next turn to dig for our own gecko moria. They play Sudo. Oh my god. Can they really get rid of our Doflamingo? Come on. He's at 8 cost. Ice Age would bring him to 3, and then Leader would bring him to 2. Oh wait, his Leader can't attack. Right, I Doflamingoed him. So he need, he'll need an Eruption and uh, Ice Age. Rebecca brings back a Hina. That will bring him to 4. Okay, he's a 4 cost. What else can you do? Ice Age and then Luchi. Or Great Eruption Luchi. Brand new. Okay, he doesn't have the answer. Alright, that's good for me. Can't find everything every time, right? 
Okay, Gecko attacks us for nine. We have to take this. No counter, scary. They pass. Woohoo! We'll tap Rebecca. Kill Rebecca. We'll kill Hina. Then how about another Doflamingo? Freeze, freeze, freeze. Pass. The only very variable that we can't control is that brand new, the bald guy. If both of these Doflamingos can survive, we'll just keep playing blockers after that and keep swinging 10k at him. Hopefully that's enough. Please be enough. Okay, they cycle the Hina out. Does Shigi search for an answer? No Ice Ages, please. Oh, at least we have two Doflamingos now, this time. Okay, they pick up a blocker Borsabino. That's fine. I think. I can tap it. Okay, the greater option that might just be the cycle. I'll do Sabo Borsolino next turn. Okay, there's Borsolino and that's their turn. Oh, two Borsolinos. Okay. We'll tap one. Uh, 10k at Borsa. Then we'll do Sabo. Kuzan. Another Doflingo would be pretty devastating. Nah, I think we don't need it anymore. Who's enough? Okay, Dawn Leader attacks 6k into Hina. They save her. Then how about 10k into Hina? She dies. Pretty sure. Then we'll play Borsa Pass. Okay, we're in pretty good shape, I think. But I think it could still go either way. We're immune from KO at least, but not from bottom deck, but he'll need a lot of cost reduction. The bottom deck are Doflamingos at this point. And I think a lot of his cost reduction is gone. One eruption, two eruption, two Helmblaze. No, all of his eruptions are gone, actually. He used all four against me. Two Helmblazes are gone. So he has two more. And he needs his Ice Ages if he runs any. We trashed the 2k. I can top deck a Gekko Moria, it'd be pretty devastating for him. Yeah, so I'll just block his Gekko Moria with my Borsa. Oh, there's the Ice Age. I guess he can bottom deck our Sabo. But yeah, we'll still have two Doflamingos they have to worry about. <laughs> Oops. I don't know why it changed scenes there for a second. Okay, so they Houndblaze our Borsa, or our uh, Sabo, and then buff their brand new. Can I lock the scenes in OBS so it doesn't switch? If I misclick, it'll take you to like <laughs> something I don't I don't mean to show. Yeah, leader six. Counter two. Hmm. Do we just tap Borsalino and go for lethal next turn? They play brand new. So we know that one card in their hand is a pseudo. They play the pseudo out. Another Helmblaze. Make their brand new a nine. Nine ten. Oh my god, we're gonna die from that. No, we have enough counter, actually. We counter 10, 2, 4, yeah, so we'll take this. Then even Borsalino attacks, we'll counter 1. Ekomoria 10. 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, now we go for the win, hopefully. Bonus 7. Doflamingo 10, and then this should be enough. 11. Exact lethal. Nice, we got it. One more. That's what I get when I get a good start. Or a decent start, that wasn't even the best start I could have. Go second. We won going first, maybe that's the answer. I think brand new is a good keep. Hey, Tashigi. We have brand new Ansabo to search for our Moria. Ooh, they have the Ice Age ready, locked and loaded. Gotta keep note of that. Oh, we get the Moria, so I guess we're just discarding to fill our discard. All right, yeah, of course. <laughs> to fill our discard with stuff that we want to bring back with Moria, we'll take a 2k here. That's what I meant to say. We'll just play Kuza not for him to die. At least he replaces himself, and he'll eat up some, like, two cards at least from his deck. Okay, 6k and then brand new, right? We'll take this 6. Ooh, Duma. I want to play Ryuma instead. There's brand new. 
up to brand new. Or I guess, no, we don't need to do it now. We'll just kill brand new with brand new. Or the counter. Okay, leader 5 into brand new. And we'll play Kuzan. Pass. We'll save Ryuma for their Luchis. They haven't played a Luchi against us yet, though. But yeah, I have bigger plans for this Ryuma for later. Eruption. Could be the Luchi coming now. Leader attacks brings one of them to one cost. Right? Or they could uh, Helm Blaze. But they have the perfect setup for a Luchi right now. Oh no, they Helm Blaze. Murakumo then? I think we're okay with that. Oh, they Helm Blaze in the end. What's the second Great Eruption for? I don't know. Okay, 5k into brand new, right? Bet us. Counter 1. We're gonna leave our brand new up. Okay. I think we're comfortable going to two. Brand new into Tashigi. On leader six. Play Sabo. Put Ryuma and BP5. S. They play Bald Guy. Pick up a Hound's Blaze. Now that I'm calling it Hound's Blaze, like ironically, I might permanently say it unironically. I hope not. I want to call it Helm Blaze. Okay, Rebecca into Hina. Oh, they don't have Dawn for Helm Blaze after. There's a Hina anyway. They attack us for 6, we'll just block counter 1. Yeah. Block counter 1. Tap Rebecca. Brand new into Rebecca. Then 5 out leader. They take. What do we bring back? Ryuma and Rosanante. It's Sabo 6 in that case. Take. Ooh, great eruption trigger. Get rid of the 3k counter. Kekomoria. Ryuma and Rosanante. Yohina. S. So this is a typical Perona curve. First time I'm getting to use it against this guy. Brand new into Rosanate, sure. They're gonna play their own Gekumoria in retaliation. They do, they can still afford to swing six at Sabo. Yeah, I know like high level Sakazuki players just throw great eruptions randomly just to cycle their hand, so that's like a level of Sakazuki I'm not at yet. So he, he probably knows more than me about Sakazuki. Ooh, Ice Age or Moria. You can bring back a Luchi. Did they have one? Yes. Yes, they do. They cycle a Luchi just for, to have it guaranteed. If they attack us for five, right? We'll counter one. Moria, Luchi, brand new. Tashigi, brand new. We'll counter this for one. Yep, yep. Luchi and then brand new. Oh, Hamapo? Oh, I guess they can kill Yuma too. This way? Yeah. Yikes. Nice tempo swing. Guess we'll kill the Hamapo. That's your turn. Okay. Brand new three into brand new three. You die. Let's tap the Luchi. Like their leader for five. And then you know what's coming. Doflamingus. Freeze, freeze. Now, do I need to swing with Sabo? Yeah, I think I can afford to. Swing Sabo six. Get him to one. Nice. And then we go for game, unless they play too many blockers. We'll even defend our Sabo if they don't swing high enough. I'm thinking of removing this brook. Right, because I can tap Borsalino anyway. Yeah, maybe Brook's going to go. Yeah, they do 9k at Babo. And I said I would counter, so I will counter for 4. Then they play 2 blockers. And I just have to try to finish behind 2 blockers. I'll have Sabo as another attacker, at least. Ooh, they play Sabo. Their own Sabo. 2 Sabos. So I can't tap Sabo... That's kind of 
hard for me to deal with. I hope their second blocker is a 4 cost. In that case. Shigi? Okay, might just be a Borsa then. But they might not have another blocker at all. Hina. Hmm. No counter. Right. They cycle the Hina. So if it's a Borsa, I can Brook and then Sudu tap the Sabo. That's 7 Dawn. Is that better? 7 Dawn. Then 3, I can do 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah, they have 1 life. Yeah, okay, that's perfect lethal. 7, if, even if they counter, they can't counter the last one. So we... We Brook. Kill the Borsalino. To do the Sabo. Tap. Sabo 7. They counter, I do 7 liter and then 10 do Flamingo, I win. Perfect lethal. Yep, they counter. 7, they have to take, and then do Flamingo is enough, we win. Okay, so Brook won me the game at the, in the end after all, so maybe I don't cut him. So Houndblaze bounced to Shigi to hand, but yeah, 2 cards, 10k. The math is on my side. We got it, nice. Okay, bye. Cardi Kaizoku.